but we, we can, can get, get ourselves into. into. Oh, uh, guys, why am I so funny? You are so wholesome. Why do people keep telling me I'm wholesome? That worries me. We're just gonna try and make something. We're trying, gonna try and do something with this. £3,169 to charge. Did it work? It worked. It was brilliant. Be the start of the clip now, right? Ready? Start of the clip. What's up, guys? I'm extremely professional. I'm a wrestling fan. I actually full time stream from the beach. Mahi, 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 mahi. <laughs> we did it! Two hours and 54 minutes. You want to roll for that? I'm just going to get into it. I'm just going to get really into it. Guys, I'm a sexy boy. Can I check the label on your bra? Because those tits were made in heaven. Please do not clip any of this part. Can you finish me off? Up. Finish me off? Did you have weird it like that? Oh, fuck! <laughs> the pig just crashed! <laughs> We're not gonna juke that again, no. The jukes. The jukes. Did you see the juke, though? The jukes! I just fell off the boat. Hi, you did the hotline, how can I help? Oh, hi Phoebe, how are you doing? Say something about cold pressed pussy juice. Moose and Ruby. Sorry! I'm Nona. <laughs> oh shit, Ruby, this ship's about to go down! Water, water! Ruby, water, water! Ruby! All our stuff! Ruby! At least we had fun. Ralph, everything's going wrong. Oh shit, who's that? <laughs> Let's see what kind of trouble, trouble we, we can get, get ourselves, ourselves into. into. <laughs> <laughs> oh guys, why am I so funny? You are so wholesome. Why do people keep telling me I'm wholesome? That worries me. We're just gonna try and make something. We're trying gonna try and do something with this. £3,169 to charge Did it work? It worked. It was brilliant. Be the start of the clip now, right? Ready? Start of the clip. What's up, guys? I'm extremely professional. I'm a wrestling fan. I actually full time stream from the beach. Mahi, 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 mahi. <laughs> we did it! Two hours and 54 minutes. You want to roll for that? I'm just gonna get into it. I'm just gonna get really into it. Guys, I'm a sexy boy. Can I check the label on your bra? Because those tits were made in heaven. Please do not clip any of this part. Can you finish me off? Up. Finish me off? Did you have weird it like that? Oh, fuck! <laughs> the pig just crashed! <laughs> We're not going to do that again, no. The jukes. The jukes. Did you see the juke, though? The jukes. I just fell off the boat. Hi, you did the hotline. How can I help? Come on, This is Phoebe. Oh, hi, Phoebe. How are you doing? Say something about cold pressed pussy juice. Moose and Ruby. Sorry. I know that. Oh shit, Ruby, this ship's about to go down! Water, water! Ruby, water, water! <laughs> I was meant to have done something, and I haven't done it, and I can't remember what it was. Oh, the background's not on. What is that? What is that? There you go. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, 
how is everyone today um who was in chat uh hello chloe thank you for the the sub again um the gift sub from jedi uh would you like to i'll add that to your list of high low games you can play um hello terror hello jedi jedi not allowed i'm officially banning all gift subs from jedi also i think i think chloe was telling me the other day chloe was like oh i was trying to like i was trying to actually do a sub on your channel and i couldn't do it because jedi has <laughs> gifted me a sub for like months so i think i think chloe's good some music um i still haven't named your card that i'm supposed to rename jedi um because i couldn't find it um but i think i found it earlier um so we should be good um we're gonna be playing dead by daylight tonight um i've realized it's a little bit boring and i'll tell you why i'm playing dead by daylight again so basically um i have i think i'm all right at dead by daylight um i don't think i'm amazing but i think for for the level i'm at i'm I'm all right. Like I'm entertaining enough to like watch. I think, like I do some jukes, but they're not, they're not like crazy jukes. They're not like you know, like I'm not spinning round and flicking J's and stuff on people. Um, like I think I'm all right, but nothing, nothing majorly special. Um, but then there's there's people you can watch. Like Benjo's online right now. If you go watch Benjo, I think he's. I think I saw he's doing his last game of the night. If you want to watch someone else right now, go watch Benjo, because if it's his last game of the night, he's going to be trying to do a tombstone. In fact, he is actually do, trying to do a tombstone right now, um, which is hilarious. So he basically, he has Blood Warden, so he's going to try and... <laughs> I might even like put this stream on for you. But he's got Blood Warden, so he's hooked someone, and now they can't um, escape. So their, their exit is blocked for a certain time. Um... It looks like though someone's got off the hook and so they've messed it up for him but he does this like crazy game where he tries and kills people at the end it's really cool it's really fun to watch benjo's sick at the game um but i think i'm all right at there but one thing i kind of did once that i <laughs> i did it once but i didn't really do it is is get to red ranks and well i've got to red ranks before but to get to rank one in the red ranks so it used to be that the the ranking system was to do with the the matchmaking so you'd end up playing against red ranks you know if you were if you were really really good at the game and then they've changed it now so now it's like um that that doesn't matter um doesn't doesn't affect it at all um oh need to do a reset on the scores as well um so it doesn't make a, a difference on the, the the play at all now. It's just to do with your um overall season rank, I think. Um I just like to get to rank one, just so I can say I was rank one. We did it last time where they broke the pipping system just as we got to rank two. Um and we got to one rank one one pip off rank two. And then the pipping system broke. Um and then we kinda did the pipping system was giving you pips for for um for personal games <laughs> so we kind of cheated it a little bit oh my god dvd has come so loud all of a sudden so we kind of cheated it and we got to rank one but we didn't really deserve it we didn't really deserve that at all so today we're gonna try and get to rank one legit um it's it's not going to happen today because I need a lot of pips, but I think I'm a I'm a little bit off gold rank one. So gold it goes gold and then red ranks. So hopefully if we can make it into the red ranks today, um, Cody is going to come and play a little bit, um, but I don't think he's quite available yet. So we're going to jump in straight away and I'll go uh, I'll go solo right in solo, and we'll see how it goes to start with um and then when cody's ready cody's gonna come in i was gonna title <laughs> two best friends playing dbd <laughs> and then i thought everyone's gonna say everyone's gonna think i've done that to say they might kiss yes they will well and that is not what i meant i just meant to say 
two good friends playing DVD. 30,000 blood points. What a, what a win straight away. Right. I was playing a bit as Bill earlier because I had like a, a thing to play as Bill. They won't. Hey, look. Who knows what happened, Jordy? Who knows what happened? We all know Cody kissing Mikey. Yeah, but we all know I got a Mikey mask, so, you know. I was playing a bit of Minecraft with Cody yesterday, and um, they, I spawned a load of villagers in his house. Um, well, f no, at first, one of the villagers just randomly walked into Cody's house. But then when he came in, he went up to, like, Cody's, um, like, uh, one of Cody's tables and then became the job related to that table. So I think he became a blacksmith. Uh, but then you had Cody with, like, a Michael Myers skin to play um, Minecraft. And then you had the... <laughs> the guy who was then dressed in like a leather outfit and i was like cody this looks pretty kinky and then um cody was like i need a name tag so he named his husband as he called him little pig boy <laughs> so <laughs> i was like jesus christ cody um so cody named him little pig boy and uh then uh because cody had a husband i spawned um, about 40 villagers in his house. <laughs> and then they cut, they kept, like, they kept using Cody's stuff and, like, getting jobs. So, like, suddenly he had a farmer in his house and a, and a, um, a map maker guy and stuff like that. So I was like, Jesus Christ. Um, so then Cody tried to lead them all out the house. Um, but I just, I just, while he wasn't looking, I was just killing them. Because I'm evil. completely got confused who i had a message from then um but yeah you can see so i'm ranked two at the moment i'm two pips off being gold rank one so we need basically seven pips today to get to thing so <sighs> i was gonna play as bill but you know what i'm just gonna switch to i'm just gonna play LED tonight we're gonna we're gonna stay with what we know Um, I think we're going to take alert off and we're going to use something instead of alert. What I'm really tempted to do is I'm really tempted to just run unbreakable. Or what's the one, what's the one where whatever I wiggle, I can turn. I, I'm really tempted to run power struggle. I keep, I keep having killers walk through pallets lately. Should I just run power struggle? I don't know. I can't decide. I'm not I'm not big brain when it comes to this. But yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna play this tonight. There'll be nothing fancy. It'll be some standard DVD. And we'll see how it goes. Here we go. I've just realized I've got my own stream open as well. That's good. All right, I might I should take an item. I should I should just run through an item. Maybe I'll I'll take a health kit. Nona. Nona, if you would like to play high low, then let me know. Thank you for the sub though. I think I've got like a special sub message now. There you go. Thank you for the sub. If you'd like to play Taff's High Low for a chance to win a £50 Steam or Amazon voucher, please let me know. Also you can DM Taff your address to get sent a pack of big Taff Man stickers. <laughs> you will in a little while. No worries. I thought you were playing this earlier. How's how the game's gone? 
I've decided you still need the Sven sticker. Have you not got the Sven sticker? Oh shit, I'll send you that, Luz. I still haven't sent your um your hoodie yet. <laughs> what is that? It's my glass. Last one was awful. It do be like that sometimes. You're in bronze now? Nice. Yeah, I, I decided I want to I wanna get to red ranks. But I what I really want to do is I want to get to... What's the word I'm looking for? Hitting with the same players again. I want to get to red red rank one. Because Nona was there when we kind of we kind of cheated it to get me to red rank one. <laughs> so I'm gonna be trying to do a bit of everything in the game tonight. How is this possible? If there are three, there's a chance. Okay. Wasn't cheating. It was a little bit of cheating, no no. Oh, is that doctor? It is doctor. That <laughs> wasn't cheating, it was legit. I can say that what I was really frustrated about was that they broke the Pippin system. So it would have been legit. But it didn't end up being legit. If he stays down there, though, we can get... Okay, that's nice. But... Need a spread of gens. That's bad, because... He's going to come straight towards here now. He's actually carried her all this way. Now, he saw me going that way. Which way has he gone? It's gone that way. Okay, we have a window here. He's seen me do the fake now. Wait, he's checking it for someone else? <gasps> <The party! laughs> Esoteric, thank you for the 10 bits. Oh, that sucks. He saw me. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, Esoteric. I moved way too late then. That was that was bad moves. You gotta ask, what on earth is this? What have you gotta ask? What is this? What is this game? You've seen me play this before, haven't you? Or do you mean the little pop-up? Okay, we trade in. Okay, he's coming for me though.
the game. Oh, this is this is Dead by Daylight. This is the game that I probably play the most out of all the games I play. Uh, so basically, we there's four of us. The 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 names of the people are on the other side of the screen. There's four of us and one killer. We have to start. Fuck's sake. I fucked this up really badly here because I completely forgot that I need to mend. Uh, so there's four of us and then there's a killer. So the killer is trying to kill all of us before we manage to do our goals. So our goal is to start the start five of the generators. So there's um, there's seven generators on the map and we have to try and start five of them. This person here has been hooked. Um, yeah, that's my mum's favorite game. Kind of like Total Recall meets Among Us. Kind of. Why am I seeing a pallet there? Um, but yeah, we have to start Sussy Ray. It's a, it's a doctor. So is he going to go for me or is he going to, if he goes for that David, I wouldn't mind. That's fine. You're good. I have a thing to start generators though, so I really need to get back to my generator. Same thing. David, get out my way. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. There's a window here. Am I going to make the window? It did make the window. So I think he's chasing someone else. I'm also... My whole thing in this game is that I'm supposed to be... Oh, shit. I'm supposed to be starting gens, and I just have not t started a gen. Where did that girl go? I shit myself. I thought she was the killer. Alright, okay, so that person's dead. They've been hooked three times. What's all the yellow things? So I've got a perk on this called um, Windows of Opportunity. So it basically lets me see all the places where I can vault a pallet or jump over something. Um, so that's all the places where I can like jump over something. So it's it's to make it, it's a thing that like helps with being able to like loop and stuff. So I'm assuming he saw me then. So I've I've just used a um a thing there that lets me slam the doors on a locker and then I lose my uh my tracks. So he can see like scratch marks that show him where people have been running. Considering I need to pip in these games, this is awful for me. So I was trying to bait him into chasing me then. He didn't go for it.
Now he's chasing me. Okay, so that went all right for me. Oh shit, I've led him straight back to the other person. So that went badly. So I'm gonna loop around here. He's chasing the other person, I'm guessing, at this point. No worries, Gecko. So I was trying to lead him away. So I know that there's a generator here. Okay. They haven't been hooked yet, so they're good. Oh, I've got to snap out of it before I can do anything. This is really bad for me. I'm fairly sure that is not a real pallet. Why do I keep just running into this David? Okay, so he spotted the David. So I'm going to snap out of it. I'm going to try and get back to this person. So it looks like he knows I'm going back here now. So he's heading back here as well. I've got a thing called borrowed time. Which lets them take a hit now. They're not going to take the hit for me though. They're going to just run off. Hey Cody. So we know that David is being like super immersive here. There's the, the Feng. The Feng was working on gens and stuff. Looks like the Feng is going to come in. David's also self-caring. That's okay. Okay, I'm kind of hoping he comes. It's gone for her. So I'm going to go back and try and get to that gen. I don't know what the David's doing. So this gen has regressed loads. Okay, he's found the David. The David's actually taken a chase here. Is he going to go for the David or is he going to come back to gens? No, he's chasing the David. The David's ran straight into him. There's a... There's a... Huck right there. But he's going to bring him all this way. So he's definitely got iron grip. That's a fake pallet. <laughs> going to risk it. Am I running straight? I am running straight into him. Fuck! Hopefully they're gonna- Oh, this is me dead, isn't it? Yeah. This is a good doctor, though. He had the moves. I don't- I don't think they'll get out. The David was was playing quite like um quite I'm trying to think of the word, not not tamely. It was it was very carefully um for the first half of the game. We didn't actually start any generators. We touched a lot of generators. We actually did pip though. So we need one more pip for red rank. Uh, for 
gold one. Yeah, this guy was very good. I enjoyed that though. I, I never rate the do you have fun. Um but I've seen Benjo doing it a lot, so I'm gonna try and remember to do it now. That's a that's a death to start the night though. Okay, so let's get Cody in here. You're the only one not to die to hook until the end. There you go. That's the way it goes sometimes. Um, I'm trying to work out what to put in this slot. Should I put Iron Will? You can play the high-low now? Yeah, sure. Just give me two secs to just... I think I'll just put Iron Will in. Or taps. Could put taps. Taps I don't seem to get as much value out of at the moment. Saboteur for the blood points. Saboteur for the blood points. Right, okay. Let me grab the cards. I'll just give them a little brief shuffle. Because they haven't been shuffled since last stream. Oh! Been having a been having a little bit of a move round in the room again today, um, so the it's throwing me off balance a little bit. Um, just been sorting some things out. Hey, Ben. Right. Hi, low. What's up, guys? It's time for another edition of A Tav's Hi, Low. And today's contestant, it's only known of things. Oh my god, it's loud in my ears. Oh god. <laughs> I didn't realize I didn't put the app. Hello, Nona. Your starting card is a six. Oh, nothing. Does now, all right? I hope you lose on the first card, you jerk. Higher? Queen. Ah, damn, damn. Bloody brats. Lower than a queen. It's a two, it's Barry the baddest. We all love Barry. Was was considering drawing a Barry emote today. Higher is a ten. Um the problem with drawing a Barry emote though is that Barry's a black dragon. So I confused as how to draw it. Lower? It's a king! Yes! You suck. You suck. You suck. You stink. You stink. I prefer known to you. Get out of here. I prefer known to you. Yeah, you that is known now, though. Go back home. Go back home. Boo. What's that about? <laughs> oh, your mum's a hoe. Your mum's a hoe. It was bad luck. Sorry, Nona. And and needless to say, we have yet to have a match. Cody's playing as Leon today. Wow. I uh I wonder if Cody bought the shirtless Felix skin. That's what I was expecting to see at some point. Yeah, it's uh there was something I meant to do. Spending money on this game is Kappa. Your Kappa. Your mum's Kappa. <laughs> Got him. Uh, <laughs> Cody talking in the in-game chat. You've got four monitors, Cody. Um, I bought... Uh, 
bought some pins from a dodgy website yesterday. Interested to see if they turn up. And also, I was excited because I was looking at, I was looking at Funko Pops, <laughs> which I know are lame, but they, they released like some rocky ones a while back, and I was like gutted that I didn't get them. And like on eBay now, they're like a ridiculous amount of money. I think it's like four hundred quid for the rocky th Funko. And I was like, I'm not, but I'm not paying four hundred quid for a rocky Funko. Like I'm, I'm not that dumb. And uh, and then I saw. So they're they're releasing like 45th anniversary ones is it 45th anniversary it can't be 45th can't be what year did rocky come out rocky uh 1976 so it is it's 45 years this year this year jesus christ rocky came out in 76 that's mental. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's one of my favorite films. So when I saw they were doing forty fifth anniversary ones, I was like, oh, that's perfect because now I don't have to, I don't have to worry about it. Um, we are playing with Cody tonight. Um, if you don't know Cody, it's one of my favorite people. Um, he's a very very good friend of mine. Um got to know cody in uh probably around september of 2019 um was kind of when when i think he first happened upon my streams um i've become like someone who's uh really important to me so it's good to do these streams because i can get on people who i can go hey look this person's really cool and even though um like Cody's not going to talk and Cody doesn't stream so you don't get to experience Cody in the full way that I do <laughs> wait what that sounds wrong <laughs> wait I mean <laughs> you don't get to you, you know I, I'm not going to be sat here saying oh go follow Cody all the way through this stream because Cody doesn't stream and stuff Cody wants to plug anything else Apart from Michael Myers. Um, he can. But you know, hopefully... You guys get to see Cody in the streams all the time. And... Uh, get to realize, like, what a, what a great person he is. And these are, these are a good excuse to... To get on some really good friends of mine. And... You know, maybe just some other streamers and stuff as well. Is it Mikey or Ghostface? It's a lurky, lurky one because the the woman next to me was just pointing at him. Wait, is that? That's not. Oh, it's uh. It's Billy. Hey, Charlie. Yeah, tomorrow we're going to be playing with Chloe, who obviously is a streamer. So we'll be doing lots of plugs of Chloe's streams tomorrow. Oh, shit. But yeah, this is a good opportunity to, you know, one play with friends of mine and uh yeah share the love will i take the mick out my friends maybe wait is that cody there Go on, go. Don't 
don't know where he's gone. I was trying to distract him for Cody. Don't know where Cody's gone either. We seem to have a bunch of gen jockeys in though, so... Gone to kick the gen. Yeah. There you go. Oh shit. How the fuck? He's lost his thing. He's has he transferred his terror radius to something someone else? If we... Oh, he's given up on Cody to chase me. What's he doing? I'm really confused. Is he not using his chainsaw at all? He's just run off from me. <laughs> I have no clue what is happening in this game. Either this guy's playing some kind of meme game or something weird's happening. Could be a cheeky blood warden. It's not no Ed. Did he open the door himself? He did. I do not know what is happening in this game, guys. I am going to just sabo a hook or two because... Oh, there's Cody. He's at the gate still. Yeah, he's, he's just hanging out at those gates. The other gates here? Where are the other gates? Okay, they both escaped. Oh, the other gates are there, where Cody is. I'm just gonna run out. There's no no messing around for me. No trolling. I don't know what was going on with that game. <laughs> like maybe maybe some kind of meme game.
That's us into into the gold, though. Into gold one. He was using just Tinkerer, but it, I didn't see him use the... Wait. So how did he... Oh. Yeah, so he used Tinkerer, so that's how I didn't find him when he went to the basement. But he literally ran past me. I have no clue what he was doing that game. A strange game. But hey, an escape's an escape. We will take it. Escape number one of the stream. That's that's one and one today. I'm also at the same time, I'm just trying to do the rift stuff. The rift closes in a day, which was the other reason that I wanted to play this today. Because I actually need to get like like 15 uh, rift ranks. Now I've got a load of, load of points, so I can actually just buy it. But I thought I'll just see how far we finish up in the rift. Um, but there's a LED outfit. I want to make sure I get the LD outfit. We could even change. We shouldn't probably shouldn't wear the Christmas outfit anymore. Should we go back to what wearing the the bear of gifts outfit? We can also look at the obviously keep the 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 pride one on, or maybe we'll take a little bill and. Noam Chomsky? Noam Chomsky. What a guy. But yeah, how's, how's everyone's days going today? Um, anyone do anything exciting? I was meant to go to the football today. I didn't go. And my team lost. So that's fine. hang out with some nerds well was there a, a bunch of mirrors around you cody hey got him Yeah, I played a little bit of Project Zomboid with a bunch of people earlier, and uh, that was quite fun. I, I kind of want to learn the game a bit better. Um, this this nearly was uh, a Cody Taft Project Zomboid <laughs> stream. Start putting the guests on the playlist for a few DJ sets. I, I saw about that in, um, you put that in SBS, yeah? I was gonna, I was gonna say some music that I like, but a lot of the stuff that I like is is older. Rachel always jokes that like none of the stuff I listen to is past like two thousand and five. Centerfold by the Jay Gallus Band. That's a tune. Is it Jay Gallus or Jay Gills? Um, waiting for a star to fall. That's a that's a banger as well. Uh, waiting for a star to fall is uh, best known as a track that was used on the film four men and a little lady <laughs> but yeah so that's that's why you don't get recommendations of music from me aside from that um we had we had a little bit of a move around in the room today i kind of show you but to be honest like i don't think anyone really remembers what the room looked like before <laughs> but i need to i need to finish moving a few bits around um one thing i need to position better is the the kettle because now i've got all the tea in here so there's now now a, a chair in the corner of the room 
So if Rach ever comes in while I'm streaming, she can just chill out in the chair. <laughs> you have nothing against all the music. I'll try and uh, I'll try and put some songs in there at some point then. But also, I have a really bad memory. I need to try and get a haircut at some point. Um, I was going to shave for this stream. Um, but I thought I won't for now. Um, and we'll see if I can maybe on uh, see how things go. We've got the scruffy otter in the house. And Sarah 2015. I hope that's not the year she was born. I have readied up. I've got my med kit. I need to start. I need to have my hands on five generators when they start. So it probably won't happen in this match unless we go full on. I could. I could take. I could take a really nice. I don't know why I've just decided that I really want to do this this month. Like it's something that I'm not really ever normally bothered by. And it's so close to the end of the season as well. But I've been playing there a bunch offline. And I never play games offline. <laughs> never have time. So, um, I haven't really drunk any tea today, um, because I haven't had time, because uh, I was fannying about with stuff. Rachel was away last night, so, um, we didn't, we didn't obviously do a stream last night, but I was hanging out with, the, um, I was hanging out with Cody yesterday, we were watching a bunch of videos and stuff, and then, um, I decided I was going to let the dog come and sleep on the bed, and he never gets to sleep on the bed. So I went and woke him up and it was really sweet because he was like completely fast asleep. <laughs> and he didn't even wake up when I walked in the room. So I, I made a little video so that I could send it to Rach to show her. Um, and he was just completely asleep. And I, I got to give him a little stroke and like wake him up gently. And then he, uh, I took him outside for a wee. And like he was all confused because like normally he gets up in the morning and goes for a wee. And I think he got up and it's all dark outside. And then I, I took him upstairs and he was like, I went to sleep pretty quickly. He like crushed up against me. So he was taken up like half the bed because of the way he was laying at least. And uh, the half the bed he was taken was the middle, <laughs> the middle section. So there was a bit on either side of him. And, uh, and yeah, he, uh, he was kind of like, just about after about an hour, he woke up. Oh, it's uh, Pinhead. I don't see the box. Why is Jake running off already? How weird. Okay, I'm not used to this. Uh, 
Where the fuck is this box? Fuck. Okay, this is going to be a tough game. Oh, Cody's doing the box. Oh, has he left the person to, to go for Cody? I'm assuming so. But I'm like 50% on this gen, so I... Oh, Cody's taken a hit. Oh, I see Cody. Shit. Do I see Cody or is that Jake? Jesus Christ. Another hunt already. Jesus Christ, this is... This is a good pinhead build. Right, let's see if we can save this. We cannot. Where did you go in? This is a very frustrating game. The This pinhead build is not one I've seen before. Right, let's go for the save. Wait, is that Cody? Cody, do you want healing? Okay. Okay, I need to need to get this guy healed up. Did a cheeky sabo on that hook. We're good. Oh, Jake. Jake, you fucker. Okay, we need to lock it up here. He saw that. Fuck. Okay, I need a window. There's another pallet here. Got the pallet early. That was good, that was good, that was good. We got out of that. But we did run into the Jake like three times. <laughs> that, the next hunt is looking quite close though. Deception's charged up again. I have no clue where he's gone. I'm guessing that Jake ran into him again. He's there. Really could do with getting rid of the boxes here. Oh 
Oh shit. Oh shit. Wait, where's... Fuck. I tried to get over there to do the save, but the, the, the things fucked me up. Can I get the save here? Surely he's gonna come back. Cody tried to take the hit. Unlucky. Unlucky. But I do have to wonder, how is how is how have the others not got a gen done in this time? Like what what has gone on there? That's what I'm confused about. Oh shit, there's a there's a hex tote right next to my Whew. Interesting. It feels like a trap though. Gonna risk it for this because I didn't see anything bad happen with the other one. I'm gonna try and get back onto this gen, but it's regressed loads. Another hunt has started. This hunt is fucking me up. Early with the pallet again. Walked right into him. Fuck's sake. I mean, I had I had the oblivious. I didn't. I couldn't hear his heartbeat. But I uh, I was trying to get back round to to do the deception play. This is a really interesting build. Like, I actually want to see the end of the game to see what the build is. Okay, Sarah's on the box. He's. I'm fairly sure he's transported to Sarah. So hopefully Cody comes this way. Is this a bad time to ask? Oh shit! I missed the skill check then because I looked at chat. Uh, we're one for one today, but this guy is totally outplaying us. I'm hoping at the moment that he's transported to Sarah, who is down there. Cody over there is on his way to get us. Hopefully if we can get off the hook. And if we can heal up before... Oh, fuck. I should have healed. I should have just finished that hook, Sabo. Okay, Cody, you're going to have to cancel this if you see him come in because I can, I've still got blindness. Or the one that gives me no sound alerts. He's coming, isn't he? Cody. Is Cody being chased? I just can't tell now. Oh, he's he's here. He's gone for me rather than that guy though. Which is good. So we're gonna try the locker fake again. 
We know this is not going to work. Oh, I missed the I missed the thing. Am I going to get it this time? So it's most likely he's avoided that. Oh, fuck. How did we get away with that? Oh, <gasps> fuck. There's a pallet here. We're just getting really lucky with where these are falling right now. But we can't stay lucky for that long. Oh, I'm on a pallet as well. Oh, we were so close. <laughs> we were so close to pulling that down. It's unlucky. This guy is really good. I'm re I'm really interested to see like what the build is here. Like I don't know much about killer builds anyway, but this guy has totally outplayed us. Good job on the Happy New Year's in chat. Although it's it's the third now. Leave it out. Hopefully, hopefully Cody gets out. We got the we got the big Cody plays now. We know Cody's gonna do everything he can here, um, because if there's one thing we know about Cody, um, he knows how to juke, knows how to jive, he knows how to stay alive. Oh, is the guy leaving that person on the floor to, to like? Bait Cody. Cody's stolen my um my med kit there. Oh, he's seen you. You can't jump through that window, Cody. I'm sorry to say. There's a pallet in inside. I don't know if you'll have time for it. Yeah, this this guy is really good. I, I just want to see his build, really. So we're going to have to watch till the end. So there dies Cody. Oh, Cody had the flashbang. <laughs> Thank you for the wasted redeem, Jordy. Imagine if Sarah had unbreakable. Oh, in the basement for the finale? Oh, she's not wiggling. And he didn't go basement. Is he going to be nice? Are some redeems cheaper? Yeah, I, I made a bunch of redeems cheaper because um, I just thought it was uh, it was nice to make um, some of them cheaper and make them come up a little bit more. Oh, he's wiggling? He's telling him no. Oh, he's insisting on wiggling. Why is she... Oh, uh, does she not know? Or did she see the... Is she telling him to hook her? I'm really confused. <laughs> I want to see his... I want to see his build. What's she doing? She really didn't trust him. Thank you for redeeming high low feeds. I will uh, I will get to that in a sec. And just so you know guys, every single penny the stream makes goes to charity. Um, the charity we're supporting at the moment is um, is Fair Share. Uh, Fair Share basically help people to um, to eat.
let's have a look at the build then. So, uh, hex plating. Uh, only, only the. Oh, right. Okay. First time you hook a survivor, they become cursed. They suffer from oblivious. Thanatophobia. Deadlock. Deadlock he didn't need at all. And Starstruck, which I've seen Starstruck used a lot. And then uh, increase the possessed chain's mental and travel meters when a chain hunt is inactive. Yeah, so we have to be right next to the the thing to see it. That's why I couldn't see it at any point. I didn't know there was an add-on for that. That was that was a rough match, though, for from the point of view of the surviving side. I might take a uh, I might take a toolbox this time. I might take my festive toolbox. Take a big fancy boy. Uh, increase increase the repair speed by thirty percent. It's already increased by fifty. And then add charges. 12 charges or should we go for the yeah we'll do the charges and we got altruism ones oops right okay phoebes are you ready Um, we've had one game so far tonight, and that one game was a loss for Nona. So hopefully Phoebe can turn it around in this, the next game. What's up, guys? It's time for another edition of Atas Hiolo! And today's contestant is Flablum... Flablamnon. Flablamnon. It's Baby Jack to start, which I like to call high or low. We have yet to see the instant win card tonight. We saw the instant win card on our last stream. Lower. It's a two. Sorry, on our last stream. No, not our last stream. We didn't. I don't think we played any games of high low on Sunday. Hide again. Yeah, it was nice. It was nice. Go back home. Oh. Oh, your a and I, I shuffled the cards oh. at the start. You, you don't have great luck with the cards. <laughs> you don't have great luck with the cards, Phoebs. I'm sorry. Shit, I don't think I actually tweeted to say I was live. Did I not tweet? I'm supposed to put things on Facebook as well now. I um I set up a Facebook page for the for the stream, <laughs> which I feel weird about weird about because like I don't know will that work? Like, do people look on Facebook for gaming? I don't know, but we set one up anyway. Are we really an hour and 15 minutes in already? And we've only played three games? Jesus Christ. 
the 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 queue times are bad on this game at the moment. And, and having said that I was going to put it on there, I've completely forgotten to put it on there again. <laughs> Although I have kept up. I'm on my day three streak of Duolingo. So we're back on the bird app. I am working on it. Who knows how well the bird app will go. But we'll keep trying. Hopefully by the end of the year, I'll be a fluent finished speaker and i'll be able to say things like that word that cody doesn't like which i'm not gonna say because i'm streaming with cody now so we we'll be kind to cody tonight no bully cody tonight <laughs> you could say that i um so we're not gonna bully cody tonight there there'll be no there'll be no if i if i if I see anyone, <laughs> you would have finished. Oh, no. If I see anyone in chat, say the Cody is strong. There'll be, there'll be trouble. Cody's weak. No one say Cody's strong. Shall I taste one of my um, Finnish biscuits? I've got some Finland biscuits here. We've got these Moomin biscuits. We could do an an impromptu taff review, but not without the thing. Cody's Cody's not strong. Cody's weak. This is a uh, this is Domino. Apparently, Cody tells me that the st the normal Dominoes are better than Oreos. <laughs> so we're gonna try one of these Dominoes. I don't know whether this will be any good. Um, they might. Oh, we have a streamer in the game. Do we think? Do we think the streamer's live? Should we look? I've got distracted from doing this. Is that a streamer? Streamer with an LED skin? Oh my god. Who who would believe? It? Wait, there's another streamer. There's two streamers. All the streamers. <laughs> I'm gonna put my LED skin back on. Uh, oh, okay. I'm going to try one of these. I'm going to open it up now. The other streamers don't want to say hi to us. Although, I think they're console players, so they might not be able. Oh, they do you have cake? Thank you for the follow. This is a pear smoothie, Domino. Let's uh, let's go check out his do you have cake stream. Oh, do you have cake? Post in the chat as well. Wait, do you have cake streaming? Do you have cake is not streaming? Okay, so if we escape, we'll get we'll get some follows going on, but only if we escape. If there's no escape, Ben has a lot of points. <laughs> Phoebe hasn't got enough points. Oh, I'm supposed to give you giving points out for when we escape, aren't I? Should I give retroactive points out? This is really weird tasting. Cody, I don't recommend these. I know you said the original ones are good. They're, they're... 
uh, they're they're kind of like the pear taste is really it's really strong pear taste. Really strong. Okay, here we go. No, we dance enough. Now we play. Oh, I could have done with nailing the skill check there. Holly's being chased somewhere. We've got this, we've got this. Lovely stuff. And it's Hummy Mummy as well. I can't remember how many generators we needed to touch. Does anyone remember? Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! Hello Hummy Mummy! gonna be bad isn't it we haven't had a bad totem in ages Cody's gone run off for some reason Cody's taken it away did she come down here This is this is good for us. Gonna kick this in. That's two gens down. Sounds like we're running right at her. I could do with checking that I've definitely got the headphones on the right way round. She sounds like she's to my left right now. She is. Okay, someone's someone's duping her around Killer Shack. Oh, it's Cody. I wonder if the... She lost him? Oh, he's looped her again. Cody's looping for his life right now. She's given up on Cody. She's left him. She's ran off. She's about to come straight back when she sees this gen pop. She did not come back. Let's see if I can find Cody. Oh my god. Cody's gonna have all the chase points. Oh, has Cody got have you got on the one? Cody where it um it does half you when you when I'm healing you. And oh, no, I don't want to medicate, it's alright. I've got it. You don't want me to save her? I wanna save her though.
That's good. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, no, Cody, this has all gone wrong. <laughs> The other guy who she's going to now, he should be fully recovered. Don't go, get the girl off the hook. Don't get me. I fucked that up completely. <laughs> she's going to tunnel. No, she's going to pick me up. I think she might be blinded. Oh god. Okay, I took the BT hit. She's going for me. I'm leading her as far away as I can. I don't know if this door is open or not not okay she's she's going for me oh the other door's there fuck is no one at the other door Where's cake? Oh yeah, she had to mend me first. Completely forgot about that. I don't know where cake is. Is cake out? Is cake safe? Cake is out. Okay, I'm going out as well then. We're 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 safe. Jesus. <laughs> Thanks, cake. I'm gonna I'm gonna come drop you a follow. I was I was worried about uh I was worried about that game then. I wasn't sure how that was gonna go. And and your pal as well. But yeah, GG's. Oh shit. Yeah, I th I think that was that was like, I think we made that harder than it needed to be. <laughs> I fucked up with the with the bit at the end. It's a good job Cody was still around. Cause I I messed up big style. We we went completely the wrong way. Hey Holly, GGs. Yeah, I went completely the wrong way. I um. I went to try and see if I could pick him up and I dropped the pallet on him. <laughs> oh, but that's the way the game goes sometimes. But hey, 
another escape and do you know what that means another 100 points another 100 points oh we need to touch one more generator I'm gonna take the toolbox off now. I shouldn't need that now. We'll bring it we'll bring our crappy med kit for a little bit. In fact, no, we won't. Let's take Saboteur off. Let's put Flashbang on. Cause Flashbang's fun. Where is it? There. I was like, why can't I see it? I need to go through the the thing and start removing the bots from from this as well. But yeah, that's the the way the the stream goes sometimes. Sometimes we will face people who will make bad decisions against <laughs> and as long as we don't fuck it up too hard, we'll be alright. But yeah, we we went kind of the right way then. It worked out and plus I managed to lead him away far enough that everyone else could sort out. So I went and took the hit. So in balance, although I did bad things, I did some good stuff at the end. And at the end of the day, that's more important than escaping. It's that we have fun. In the words of Ruby, at least we had fun. Fucking Ruby. <laughs> Ruby, our ship's going down. Ruby, all our stuff. Ruby, Ruby. I um I know I said on stream yesterday about wanting to play uh Borderlands 3 and uh and Pink has finally purchased it. So hopefully at some point we'll play some Borderlands with Pink. But yeah, if anyone else wants to play Borderlands at some point, I would play multiple games if anyone wanted to play. God. I um, completely forgot to keep up my run of ring fit today as well. I did bring this stuff up in case I can do it before the end of the day, but I won't be able to. Oh shit, I've put some tea into cold brew. Completely forgot about that. <laughs> Just absolutely down that drink so I can, <laughs> can get the tea out. Ooh. I don't know. I'm I'm kind of like with three three ranks off red rank. If we can get to red rank tonight, I'd be happy. Like it feel like I've achieved something if we do that. And then hopefully going forward, I don't know if I'll have enough time. What would we need to do? If we get to red rank today, that means we'll have got six pips in the stream. And we're going to start rent. Is it red rank four? Ranking DVD. Uh, 
four to one. So we'll start at red rank four. Wait, is that right? Or is that the old ranking system? Four to two. Yeah. So hopefully that means four fives. Well, no, because we need four, eight, twelve, and then one. No. Wait. If we get into red rank four, we're going to need four to get to three. Four to... No, five to get to three. Fuck, I don't, don't know what I'm talking about anymore. <laughs> we got EO Molly F in the house. I always like Googling, like, the weirder names. Just to see if, like... It's it's something if they if it comes up with the they're like a streamer but they haven't got TTV in their name, but E or Molly F doesn't come up with anything. Oh, and they've left. What did I say, Cody? <laughs> I was about to say like um you no, know, there's that rule that like people say is like the rule that if there's anything there's going to be like fan fiction and stuff of it i was like i think you would be a hard character to write fan fiction of but then just like two seconds later i was like no i can see it well if it comes to it, we'll just get Jedi to write some for us, though. Still looking forward to Jedi's updates of the SBS fiction. Uh, of course, that's not a rude one. Jedi Stan. He's the sad emo boy of that universe. Exactly. Right, I'm gonna grab one of my one of my teas out. So this this has actually been in for two days. So I think this is sangria tea. So you're only supposed to really cold brew them for four to six hours. It's a lovely colour though. Um, I've cold brewed this in lemonade. This is actually a really beautiful colour. I'm a bit worried though that it's going to taste a bit too strong. Pop that over there for now. But look at that. That's a beautiful red. It's going to be too strong though. Oh, that's that's nice. That is that is really nice. Matches your shirt. Oh, it's pyramid head. Pyramid Daddy, uh, Phoebe, are you are you there? Actually, I've got a question for you. Oh, it's not Pyramid Head; it's Crow Girl. on the wrong way here. Who took a hit for me then? Jay Umbridge? 
uh, yeah, Phoebe, I was wondering if you knew um, how many meals um, Vin Diesel has in the morning. I don't know if you know. How many meals does Vin Diesel have in the morning? Oh god, this is a joke. Might not be. Oh, she's coming to me. I don't know, Taff, how many? He has two. Fuck. Fuck. Uh, he has two. He has um, the Brett Fast and the Brett Furious. Did you like that one? I think that person had the thing that lets me wiggle faster. But it didn't work. Uh, she's coming to you, Leon. Is she coming back? Yeah. This is my one gen that I need to do. And then after I heal, I can drop this and go and grab a flashbang. Shit, that's Cody down. I haven't got enough time to get a flashbang. Did she hear me then? Right, we got our flashbang. She's chasing me instead. Fuck, I fucked up. I fucked up. Gone for the pickup? She? I think she'll have seen me there. She did see me. I've this this woman's good as again. Has she just tunneled that person? I think at this point we need to get some generator movement. Oh no. Oh no. I'm nowhere near close enough. Right, Cody's got that and hook. Is he going basement? No. Okay. Can we wrap around? 
No, because she's dead. Fuck, I wasn't even fucking looking. <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, this is bad for us. Cody's down now. <sighs> Don't know how to play this from here. We've only got one gen started. So it's either... I might try and see if I can get enough to make a flashbang. Oh, no. Will she have got an alert for that? I don't see her. Yeah, of course she was. That was so clever of her. She telling me completely. No, that's okay. I don't I don't think she's too bad, pharmacy. I think I think she's a very tactical player. Like there she she faked that she was chasing Cody so that she could um so that she could turn around and, and get me. Cody, I've not I've not healed at all here, so feel free to do something else. But thank you for popping in pharmacy. I was nowhere near your thing, so I can't really say. Your medkit is somewhere with decent add-ons. I don't think it's going to do us much good at this point anyway. <laughs> Cody's down now. I guess she's going back to to look for me. We're cooking. Do you think she had a, a, a little look at the stream then? Very interesting how quickly she found me there. <laughs> Do you think she's she's going for the Mori on the streamer? Could could be the Mori. No, it's not a Mori. But there you go. That's an another death. But it's okay. That's the way the game goes sometimes. Wouldn't surprise me. Death number three of the stream. Good, good game, Pharmacy. I'm sorry the, the, that it didn't go better for us. God, my eyes went psycho then. I finished my uh, generator's goal though. Did we pip? We didn't pip, but we didn't de pip. I didn't. I didn't look at the look at the stuff then. You're gonna, gonna gonna get a snack. That's gonna be a long way to travel, Cody. <laughs> Although, <laughs> I can't say it. Stun the killer while using the perk smash hit three times. In a hundred thousand blood points. Um. What should we go for? Completely heal one survivor after the exit gates are opened. 
Although that's not bad. Antenna iridescence. Fully deplete five med kits. So we'll go for that. Um, I'm actually going to BRB as well. I'm just going to go for a pee. So I will be back any minute. Um, bear with me. Enjoy the whole music. <laughs> Snack Cody. <laughs> deep fried broccoli is? Wait, you went to the kitchen and deep fried the broccoli. In that time. So is regular as well. Hey, look. I don't know about this. Do I have them in the oven earlier and now they're ready? Wow. Get yourself a Joe. How are we doing? Fully deplete five med kits. I need a med kit. Had deep fried cauliflower? Wait, so. Are you saying, when you say deep fried, are you saying that you actually deep fried them? Because you said Joe had them in the oven earlier. So were they oven roasted or were they deep fried? Or did she roast them first and then fry them? They're like frozen nuggets or fish fingers that you heat up in the oven. Ah, okay. So they they were deep fried and then frozen. Yeah. Got it. Bow bow. Oof. I'm going to I'm going to look up some good things to talk about. Uh let's uh Did I cancel? No, I didn't. Let's let's find a good a good conversation starter. 250 perfect conversation starters for any social situation. 
The first one is tell me about yourself. Hello, I'm Taff. I'm, uh... Oh, I'm... I'm Foy. And, uh... It was about 2019. I'd dabbled in streaming a little bit. And I was like, why don't we give streaming a little bit of a... little bit of a go and try and do it properly? So, in around July, I did a bunch of streaming of 2019. And I was like, this is quite fun, but, like, I need to, like, try and take this a bit bit more seriously and one thing i really enjoyed oh my god look at that <sighs> one thing one thing i really enjoyed is going in other people's streams and using my emotes in their streams like i found that really fun <laughs> so what i thought is like i'd really like to have more more emotes um so that i'd have more things that when i go into other people's streams that i can um that i can kind of just do like drop in chat and stuff so i was like well maybe like to get more to get more emotes i need to get more subs and i'm not very good at like getting subs i don't really know how to do it so what I decided to do was I thought, well, I'll do a charity month. And I I spoke to my wife and I was like, I'm going to try and stream every day of the month. So we'll try and stream every day in August. And what we'll do is I'll say for every for every sub I get, I'll give £10 to charity. Plus all the money I make on stream, I'll give that to charity as well. So I did that. <laughs> And uh, at the time, like, I think in July, I, I my average viewers was, like, 1.5. <laughs> Most of the time that I streamed, I would literally open the, the stream on my iPad with a different account name and, like, leave that open. Like, I believe now, from what I've been told, that doesn't really help your viewer account number because it's the IP addresses and stuff. Twitch will notice it and take it off. But I don't know if that was the case at the time. And so I was literally... I was literally trying to stream and having myself watch it. Idea which oh there he is. Hello daddy. That's not good. Okay, he's left me. Back on me. He's wanting to hit the big snipes. Don't know if we... He maybe has a daily or something? Uh, but yeah, I was like... I was like, for every sub I get, I'm going to donate £10 to charity. And I ended up getting... 50 subs that month I got a bunch of good people who raided in a bunch of people we met like I think that was like around the time that I first started seeing like Chloe streams and Phoebe and Cody and Pink and, and all the SBS guys oh, fucking hell it's the first time that I ran into all of those and they were really supportive of the fact that I was doing the charity stuff I was like, hey, look, from now on, every stream is a charity stream. Um, like, I didn't have a... My first payout was in that, that August. So we got to 50 subs that month. And I had a cry. The video is on the YouTube. If anyone wants to see me cry. It wasn't the first time I cried on stream. And it probably won't be the last time. But it definitely wasn't the last time.
shit. Man, I big time got away with that. Uh, but yeah, I uh, I donated every penny we made to charity. That was really cool. And then from then on, we've been donating to charity every month. Like, I'm lucky that I've got to pay out every month since then. Which is fucking mental. Hey, cat! But yeah, I made the pledge. Every penny this stream makes goes to charity. Always has always will and uh, yeah we do we do cool prizes and stuff like we're, we're doing two things this month so we're doing the usual high low contest so if you sub give a gift sub or spend two and a half thousand channel points you get to play taft's high or low which is basically like if you get five in a row correct higher or lower you get to play you get entered into a draw to win a £50 Steam or Amazon voucher. This is bad. Okay, this is good. This is good. This is good. It was gonna happen. But yeah, the kind of charity we're supporting is Fair Share UK. They they basically they take leftovers and um you know when there's where's the hook here? Are oh, there? When there's like a supermarket that sells like loads of produce or there's a factory that has misprinted some labels and they have to chuck that food out. Instead Fair Share come and Fair Share go like, Oh, we'll take that from you. They take that food and and you know, food that is getting close to its best before date or use by date um and they will take that from the supermarket they'll say don't check it out we'll take it instead and they turn that food into meals that they use to help feed the vulnerable so people like the homeless or they use it to help other charities out and all of that food um then doesn't get wasted i believe it's one in five charities say that without the work that fair share do they wouldn't oh god Okay, I thought he was going to tunnel them, but he didn't. They say without the work their fair share do, they wouldn't actually be able to exist as charities. And that's one in five. Because you think if there's other charities out there and they don't have to worry about like, oh, where are we going to get the food come from for... Is he going to come here? No. Fuck. I hate that this bubble now appears and I can't see where he's gone. Oh, he's f chasing someone else. For God's sake, Tav. But yeah, that's a little bit about me and my streaming. Kind of nothing here. Coming back to me. I'm fucked here. Okay, we might not be fucked. We might still be fucked. 
Yeah, we 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 he was always gonna get us with that hit. I am right on that pallet though. Oh no, we're going in the cage. Cool. So what he's done there is he's put me in the cage and he puts me somewhere at the opposite side of the map. This is just for pyramid head. Um, but it's because I walked over his like barbed wirey stuff. So he's put me at like the exact opposite end of the map to him usually. Which is kind of a good thing for me now because it meant that I've ended up a bit closer to the other guys. How am I doing? I'm good. I'm good. Why is she not coming and helping with the healing? Uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's all right today. Chill day today. For anyone who doesn't know, I don't work. I'm lucky enough that I don't work. Um, so technically a full-time streamer, but not really, not in the way that some people are full-time streamers. <laughs> not in the way they're like, they're like, there's people who, you know dedicate everything you coming this way I feel like we've had some nice little chases pyramid head that's interesting he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to get into a chase with me. I'm guessing the the gens are all close together, and he thinks that I'm leading him away from the gens. Oh no! They've reversed straight into him. They're not on death hook. Yeah, he sniped him. Do you really want to get into this? Oh, it looks like he's gone to... Okay, but this should give me enough time to do this. Stay brave. Stay brave. Stay brave. Ah, she... We're going for the save. I didn't even realize it was Cody who had died until now. Oh no, she's leading him straight back this way. I'm assuming she's got self-care, so I'm not going to... Maybe she doesn't. Yeah, but you're leading me all the way over here. He's not even here. No worries, Gecko. See you later. Have a good one. Oh, shit. If anyone's, if anyone's got any questions they would like to ask, anything you've ever wanted to really know, feel free to ask it in chat. Cause it's uh it's been quite a chill one tonight so like what did everyone want to be when they were growing up like when you were a little little one Ooh, tasty
Right, will he have fallen for the deception? Did he see me go past the window then? He must have. Yeah, he saw me go past the window. The other person has not gone for the save. Oh, they've gone for the save now. Okay, we need to lead him away again. So hopefully they can get the heal in here. He's not close enough to do that. He's left me. Okay, interesting. Okay, yeah, probably best to get the gen done. This is me taking a big risk for you though here. I'm not going to I'm not going to take the heal off you. I'm going to do a big loop round to the door that was closest to him. I don't think we had time to heal there. I feel like we pipped. Did he see me? He didn't see me. Fuck. Wait, they're there? What are they doing? Is he leaving me? Because he's seen her. Or is he leaving me? Because he's enjoyed the chases. I think he's seen her. She dropped the pallet so early then. We're going to just go and chill under this hook. I don't think we're going to get out here. He might. Where's he gone? Is he gonna let me out? Is he gonna let me out? No way. He enjoyed that. Are you, have you got a Mori? Have you got a Mori? He hasn't. Oh, he enjoyed it. That's a good, that's a good. He enjoyed the chase. We had some fun. I appreciate that. I appreciate that a lot. We we had fun then. <laughs> Good luck next. Hey, that was, uh, that was really nice. Look, a rank one as well. I thought, I thought I did well there. Oh, we had barbecue. Save the best. So see, I don't know who was the obsession though. And corrupt, we knew, he, we knew corrupt. Oh, is it ranks? No, that's four, isn't it? Yeah, I thought I thought we played. Well. I thought I played well there. I didn't. Uh, I can't speak from Cody's side of it. Um, I don't know if Cody just had a 
a rough time over there. I was too busy concentrating on myself that match. I'm so sorry, Cody. He had a good, yeah. He was he was a good player. He was he was a really good player, and and that was what made it like feel all the better that, like, I felt my looping was all right. I felt like he could have had me if he wasn't trying to do the snipes all the time. But you you can also like only play against what you're playing against. And and I think I did well at what I what he was doing. Whether he was doing his absolute best, I'm not a hundred percent sure. Like I feel like if he was doing his absolute best he would have murdered us. <laughs> What's my strangest hidden talent? Is another question I've looked up. Um, I don't know if I've got any really hidden talents. I obviously I I learned the Rubik's cube last year. I don't know if I can still do the Rubik's. I could grab it out and pull. I don't either. Or like party tricks. I guess I guess thing is like more. What is something you can do that someone wouldn't really expect you to do? Like I don't think many people realize like, like in, in just like. Like five years ago, I was doing marathons. Like, I don't think people really expect that. I guess play piano. I, yeah, I didn't know you played piano. I keep trying to learn to play an instrument, but I'm I'm really bad at like keeping it keeping it up. Like, um, we talked to Chloe once because like me and Chloe were both trying to talking about like learning to play the guitar. Used to know many Muse songs. Muse are the best live band I've ever seen. I still, to this day, have like. So I I didn't like Muse, up until I went to Red in Fest, uh, Red in Leeds Festival, um, and it was a. Uh, I have to try and find the lineup. Leeds Festival. Uh, Arctic Monkeys. The Streets. Uh, Muse. What year was that? 2006? Let's have a look at this. Leeds 2006. Yeah. This was it. So this was the... This was the year that I went to Leeds and Reading for the weekend. You love Muse? <laughs> So this was 2006. I went to I went to Leeds Festival for the full weekend. Um, it's funny looking at it now because like I can see like Fallout Boy and Panic of the Disco and stuff were on on the Saturday. Don't remember seeing them at all. Um, this was the Sunday, and we we are like little group of friends. We loved um we love feeder, we loved the streets. We didn't we didn't love the streets. The streets is like this weird thing of like we had like loads of running jokes about the streets. So, um yeah, we used to I always used to say that the streets sounded like he was like, I went down the butchers to have a butchers at his meat, and guess who I did meet? It was a man. He had a plan. And that man with a plan said his plan was to take a flan and put it in a jam. And I'd always be like, that's what the street sounds like to me. And then I got really into the streets when um, when he released the al album A Grand Don't Come For Free, which is like a concept album where he basically, um, the album is meant to be listened to as a full story. I always like it when musicians do that. Um, like I really like the Plan B album that he did that. Used to play a lot of guitar and bass, but after you joined, started to fuck up, I stopped and never got back in, even though I could probably now that I got the right drugs. You should, if, you, if you'd like to, I think you should. Um, but yeah, we uh, we were like really hyped that the feeder were on, then the streets, then the Arctic Monkeys, who were just like kind of were starting to hit really big. 
and then Muse was the headline act. And I was like, I'm not really into Muse that much. So like when we were coming up to the, the gig, like I was trying to listen to as much of like the bands and stuff that I knew. Oh my God, I've just noticed Plan B was on this show. <laughs> I didn't like Plan B at the time. Um, we did go and see Goldie Looking Chain. We're on <laughs> on this Friday. Um, but yeah, we uh, we we tried to listen to a bunch of their music, and I just couldn't get into Muse. I was like, they're just not really my thing. And um, so we end up going on the Sunday, and we're we're kind of queuing up, waiting, and we get into the arena and we get into like a good position for stuff, and um, we get like right to the right to the like the middle section of the front. Like we're not we're not front front, but we're we're kind of in the middle of the like there was like a cornered off area. It was like we were in front of like where the DJ booth thing where they mix the music was, but we weren't like near the front front. So we had a good spot, so we had a good time there and then we went and got some drinks and then we came back to our spot and the streets we really enjoyed and then Arctic Monkeys, we kind of ended up getting split off a little bit. So we kind of like all lost each other. Um, so I end up somehow on the front of the of the of the um, guardrail. So I'm literally on the guardrail and I'm like, oh, Arctic Monkeys are finished, but I've ended up on the guardrail. Like I, I can't, I can't like not stay here now. Like I've got to stay here for the, for Muse. So I'll just listen to a few Muse songs. They're not my bag. So they come on and Muse, if you've never seen them live, they do these amazing light shows and stuff. And they had this sick like light and smoke and stuff. And I remember like Starlight was probably like the third or fourth song they sang. In fact, if I can find it, uh, Muse played, um, set list leads 2006 there you go found it so starlight was oh starlight was the 11th song they did so yeah i remember the supermassive black hole was the third so they did a bunch of stuff early though though that i was like oh i like this song and stuff and I was kind of getting to the point where I was like, I'm going to, I'm going to duck out now. Like I've, I've had a good time. This is fun, but like, this is, it's not really my bag. And then they started playing Starlight. And like for the, for those who don't like Star, Starlight by Muse, I, I'm going to play a little bit of it. I know I'll get in trouble for this, but I'm just going to play the opening. So the opening starts. And I'm like, oh my God. And then Matt Bellamy starts to come out of the smoke and uh, just suddenly appears like in front of me. And I can just, <laughs> I remember being really, this, I'm gonna sound a lot like someone who's on drugs right now, but I felt very much like I was like looking at my hands as an out of body experience. <laughs> Awful spins there. I totally lost her then. I did not know where she is. Um, but yeah, Matt Bellamy suddenly appeared out of smoke with all these lasers going off behind him. And I was like, oh my God, this is like the greatest thing I've ever seen in my life. And after that, I was like, I was like, Muse is the greatest live band in the world. Like you can say whatever you want. Weirdly, one of the other best live bands I've seen was Coldplay? Coldplay were amazing live. Like Coldplay do the, did, did this whole thing where um everyone who went into the arena and we had we got given free tickets to go to Coldplay by the way. 
um it wasn't that we made a conscious decision it was like someone said to us oh my daughter's working the Coldplay gig she's been given some tickets for it do you want to come and we were like yeah it was literally a day off like it was a few hours before so we went to the gig and uh they had these wristbands on they responded to the music so they would flash lights depending on how the music was going at the time um which was like awesome and like you were, we were right at the back of the arena it, it, they played at the football stadium and like we were right at the back of the arena but you could see like everything oh there's a there's a thing in there she's just gonna stay there isn't she so we could see like the whole everyone's like wristbands and stuff popping off Oh, fuck. Oh, man. You screwed this up so bad, Taff. Oh, man. Bad, bad for me. I should have dropped the the flashlight um, mi in mid game, like I in before this game. Like I picked that up from a locker. I'm not good with flashlights, and I think killers when they see that you've got a flashlight, they will sometimes like go for you because they'll think you're a stronger player. Although I I do at some point want to try and learn flashlight saves. Right, we're on death hook already. So this was the this was the one I was working on earlier. Did she have ruin? No. Well, she might have. But she doesn't now. Head it off that way. She's coming back. This is bad for us. This is very bad. taking weird lines to get to us but i don't know if that's because she's gonna she's gonna use her like ability she cut us off there no now she's using it I forget she I forget every time how nurse and spirit work I can never remember can one of them only see you when you run in
Okay, she's on Cody. So Cody went up that way. There's Cody. I can't tell you she... Is she chasing Cody? She is. She's still chasing Cody. Okay. Do I go for the flashy save? No. Okay, we're going for Cody now. Okay, she's chasing someone, but they are coming this way. They almost led her <laughs> right to Cody. Cody's going to run some distraction, I think. We're just about to pop this one. We're not just about to pop it. It's like 80%. Oh, good. This is it. So it exits right behind me. So I'm... I'm going to go to the exit door that's right near me. Okay, she's she's got to go for me here, right? <sighs> that is so lucky. I don't think we can get this off again. Cody's going for the blocks. Awful, awful. God, Cody. They're just healing at the door. The person who's been hooked once and the person who's not been hooked yet are healing at the door. Ah! GG's, Cody. Good try. Where would I go on vacation if I had no budget? Where would you guys go on vacation if you had no budget? We were meant to be going to the Galapagos Islands just before lockdown started. And instead we ended up having a baby. Oh, we're in red ranks! We in the red ranks, boy! I need to trigger the celebration. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna put you uh, watching Cody while I just go for a pierce.
Cody escape? Did Cody escape? Thank you, pals, for the save. He did, didn't he? GG. Oh, they came for the save? Nice. Uh, what, were the, what was the question? Uh, where would you go on vacation if you had no budget? See, like, um, the Galapagos was, like, meant to be the dream holiday that we were going to go on. And because that all fell through because of COVID, we ended up um, having a baby instead. <laughs> but um, what we nearly did... Like, I don't think that would have been, like, the dream no-budget holiday. I actually think the dream no-budget holiday would be, like, to go to, like, um, go to New York and stay in, like, the fucking fanciest apartment that we could. Like, I love New York to bits. Stay in, like, the fanciest apartment. What, what's, what, what other people, what would you do? as a as a dream holiday like i'm intrigued cody where's your dream holiday you go to japan and try every vending machine i could every vending machine terra nassau in the bahamas go through all the pirate museums we had a great whole day in the Bahamas. Like going to the island where the the pigs are was really fucking cool. And like the island that Nick Cage used to own. Is it 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 is. Yeah, see this is this is true. So we went to an <laughs> island. Island uh Oh, this is someone posting about it. I don't know if this is true then. Hannah was in Ex Exuma and she learned Nicolas Cage bought an island there to build his dream house. When he visited, he discovered it was infested with iguanas. So he just went, fuck that. Yeah, so th this is the story that I read. That Nicolas Cage bought an island. And, um, and suddenly realized that it was just full of lizards exuma lizards this might be something completely fake that i've never that i've never heard of with a good eye you might be able to see nick cage's private island yeah this this was really cool we did this we went to the iguana island and like you literally like your your guides and stuff will bring you give you like um lettuce and stuff like that to give to them and they'll literally walk up and take it from your hand but yeah where's uh where's the mention of nick cage on here there's no mention in nick cage like have i made this up nick cage island lizards i'm sure this is true you would probably go to multiple places though what what kind of places would you want to go to though tara oh and thank you for the follow gusilas hopefully i've said your name right there yeah we, we've been to see this as well so this is in new orleans uh this is a tomb that nick cage has bought so when he dies, he'll be put into this tomb. Because I don't know if um, if a lot of people know about New Orleans. So New Orleans, because of the, because it's technically, it's it's below water level, isn't it? Water level. Yeah. So it's it's one and a half to three meters below mean sea level. So New Orleans can flood a lot. So. <laughs> A lot of the time. Is this is this a, an accurate thing? So there you go. So 
so this is this is a map showing that the sea level is actually oh, fucking hell it's actually higher than um the new orleans is so it's got a tendency to fucking stir. so it's got a tendency to flood there you go it's got a tendency to flood a lot so the problem is that with um with the cemeteries there when they used to bury the people underground then if the city flooded the floods would disturb the se the like cemetery and would end up like washing the bodies up and also all the the water that's flooded in would um infect the, the would be infected by the dead bodies so they had to end up like getting tombs made instead so nick cage has bought a tomb in the middle of new orleans that's shaped like a pyramid and when we went past it there was loads of lipstick marks on there because people had been kissing it which also is against the law <laughs> love to see inca temple and stuff and places like that see stuff like that scares me a little bit because like obviously like i wouldn't have a clue what to do with the animals and uh Yeah. The, like, you know, the snakes and stuff. Not knowing how to deal with the snakes. Yeah, crazy insects and snakes and spiders. Because we went to Australia. And we did a thing while we were out at one point. Um, when we went to Australia... We went on this trail where I don't know how to really describe this. So I'm going to open paint and try and draw a map for you. <laughs> so we, we went to this walking trail. And so we go on this walking trail and when... It's like, so if you say there's the start and there's the end but there was a sign about halfway through that was like if you want to like probably a third of the way that if you want to go on a harder trail you can go up this way and it'll take you on a route they'll eventually come back around and meet there so we were like me and rach were like we were doing this with rach's mum and dad and her sister and her sister's boyfriend so we were like Oh, we should go on the harder trail because her mum and dad were walking quite slowly. We're like, oh, it'd be quite fun. We'll probably walk faster than you guys. We we were already, so we'll go on the harder trail. So we go, we start going up this harder trail. If I if I start writing this in red now, so we we start walking along and we we go up this trail and we start walking and we start going like up and up and up into like up up this mountain and we're like, this is like feels wrong. So we get to a point and I'm like. Should we just turn around and go back? And and Rachel's like, yeah, I think we should turn around. And then I'm like, oh, wait, here's another trail that goes this way. Should we just go down this way? Like, maybe it's a shortcut. And Rachel's like, oh, I don't know. And I'm like, no, look, you can see, like, people have walked down here. So we start walking down here a bit. And, and we come to, like, a river. And I'm like... Oh well we can just walk by the side of the river. We'll we'll end up reaching the trail again. Like the trail must cross the river. Like so we should just walk down the river. And Rach is like, I'm not sure about this. And I'm like, oh we'll be okay, you know, we'll be fine. So we start walking down the side of the river. And then we come to, to a thing where we can just see all these massive things that look like that. Now I thought they were rocks. But Rach convinced herself that they were eggs <laughs> and they were next to the river. Uh, and she was like, I don't want to go down there anymore. I don't think we're on the trail. I don't think we're like on a real thing. Like, I think rather than keeping like, I really wanted to just keep walking down. And they were like just these massive, massive, like round rocks. The Rach was convinced they were eggs. The cocoa crabs. I don't know what cocoa crabs are. Oh shit, those? No, we we just we just saw like um big round circles. 
but yeah rach rach managed to convince us that it was like that it was going to be something bad weirdly i have another story that's exactly the same as this um where once when we were on holiday uh we were in france with the family and um so we start going down we we went to this thing that was going to be like this big fancy walk we started by a river Oh, it's Blight. So you started, you, you, you started by a river and you walked down the river. Is he going to turn around and come back to me? No. Um, and you went down the river and then you'd get to the other end of the river and you'd, uh, you'd, you'd clear out the water and you were meant to, to like be in the water the whole time. So we walked down to this thing and like literally have like our our swimming costumes on and a t-shirt because it was really like sunny so didn't want to overheat and it was like like a kind of is the word a gully where there's like basically cliffs either side of the river so you're just swimming down the river and like once you get to the other end you just would would get out so we start doing this and we go down to the area where it was and there's like there's like no one else there. Like there's there's no one else doing the same walk that we're doing. Can we can we get the fake out here? We missed the fake out. Um but we start walking down this valley so we get we get down to where we thought the start was and we can see loads of people there so we get into the water and we start going down the river and as we start going down the river there's no one else um so we're like this is really weird there was like loads of people at the start like why is there no one here now so we start going down the river and we're seeing like all these like cool lizards at the side and stuff and we're like oh this is really really cool to see like and still we're seeing nobody at all and like we like we're all like my family we're all pretty good swimmers so we're not seeing anything and i'm like this is so weird and um and then suddenly we realize that the bit we walked down to was the exit <laughs> so we'd actually walk down to the exit and start going down river from there <laughs> so we quickly abandon what we're doing <laughs> and start walking trying like to find somewhere where we can get out and just find a point. Why well, walk straight into that? Okay, it looks like he might have left me. Oh my god, just running straight into a tree. It's a nice J flick. I'm gonna have to drop this. Is he gonna go for it? Think we make it? I think we make it made it there. Wow, he's fast. Yeah, this is Blight. So Blight basically has these like injections that he can give to himself. And then he can zoom like and bounce off things like three times. Um, so there you go. So he's boomed and then he can bounce. But he can only steer a certain amount while he's doing that. So here you go. Unfortunately, he's chasing Cody and Cody's right next to me. And I missed that skill check because I was scratching my head does look like someone's coming for me though cody's upstairs in the house the guy's still around the back so cody's okay right now cody started healing the other guy is completely lost no no he's got he's back on cody and this person's just saved me so they're heading a bit towards cody i'm just gonna get out of here because 
I do not need to die already. See, if he's got something like barbecue and chili, after he hooks someone, yeah, he might have had barbecue. That person's got Cody. So if he's got barbecue and chili, barbecue and chili is a perk for anyone who doesn't know. Basically shows him where people are after he hooks someone. As long as they're a certain distance away from him. So because he can get around the map so fast, that's a really good perk for him. Yeah, he's heading straight this way, look. I just sandbagged Cody. So I'm really sorry for that, Cody. I think he went for my deception. He did go for my deception, so he at least had a look at it. He's heading towards Cody, though. No, he's not. He's gone towards the bus. I think Cody got away from him. The good thing about deception is not just the the fact that I uh he's coming back to me. Absolutely sandbag Cody again. I'm sorry, Cody, for the sandbags. So I'm going to try and get him away from where he is. You were trying to take hits for me. All right, we'll take that hit. Because we can at least here now. Do that. Oh, he's he's got someone else. Cody's off hook as well. That gen that's next to Cody is so close to being completed. So hopefully if they go there, is there a door around here? There's no door around here. I've got a container here though. We can check this. There's a door over there. really do the med kit. Don't think I can get close enough for the save here. He's gonna go kick that gen. Oh shit, that's Cody's death hook? Okay, so where's he going? So really, I'm not going to go for this gen yet. Oh shit, she was here. Oh fuck. Yeah, he's come for me. This is super bad. We'll try and take him as far away as we can. We took him as far away as we could anyway. Hopefully they're, they're healing though. Do the gen. I suppose they're going to look for the hatch though. I would have probably gone for the gen though. It's another death, but that's okay. You 
got into the red ranks. That was the goal for today. So worst comes to the worst, we got into the red ranks. It's nothing to, to be ashamed of. I think Cody might actually call it there. Um, finish a bit earlier than normal. It seems real quiet tonight, so I think I think we'll finish now. Um, I hope anyone who uh, checked out the stream and hung out today enjoyed. Um, I will be back tomorrow. Uh, we'll be playing some. Um, We'll be playing some, uh, what's the, what's the name of the game? Uh, it takes two with Chloe. Um, yeah, I'm just feeling like I was just kind of <laughs> talking to myself a little bit. We always appreciate our lurkers, but it, uh, yeah, felt a bit like I was kind of just jamming onto myself tonight. So I'm gonna, gonna leave it there. Um, We'll finish off and I will be back tomorrow. Um, just having a look who's on that we can give a little raid to. GG's. No worries, child of God. That's fine. Was lagging bad? That's all right. Um, Panther's on. What's Panther doing on? We'll give Panther a raid. So Panther, for those who don't know, she's um, an American streamer. She just It just says she's playing, just chatting tonight. So I don't know if she's doing something else. It looks like a hype train's just starting in her chat. She's lovely. If you don't know Panther, um, feel free to say hello. Uh, send her some love. I will be... Um, no raid message? Okay, the raid message isn't coming up. So if you are a sub, if you could drop some new rocks in the channel. If you're not a sub, um, just say hello. Um, send the best. Panther's lovely. Um, since you changed to elements. I I think... No, elements should still have it. Um, chat commands. Custom commands. Did I change it to something else? No, it says, it says raid. Does anything else work? What if I do prof? It looks like stream elements bot has just left the channel or is not talking. Maybe it's broken. Anyway, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, bye, everyone. Bye. <laughs>